Namaste. I'm really delighted to be part of the Indian Oil Now Hear Us series presented by First Edition Arts. Today, I am so honored to be joined by Sri Shutindra Kathagari on tabla and Sri Siddhesh Bicholkar on harmonium. On Tanpura, I am joined by Sri Jayant Naiduji and Sri Surya Kant Surveji. I'll be beginning my recital with Rag Shuddha Kalyan. Vilambit Bandesh is a traditional composition in Ektal, Eri Mai Pia Ao. And the Drut composition is uh, in Tintal, composed by my Dada Guru, Pandit Dinkar Kaikini. Nena Tarasai Daras Binadeke.
Rega da baga, rega pa da baga, ga 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 da, ga ga pa, rega pa da sa ni da baga, pa ga re sa e tri ma e pi, ga ga pa ga re sa. Sare re ga ga pa ga re sa sa pa re ga da pa ga pa ga re sa ga re ga re sa re sa da ga re ga pa da pa ga pa da sa ni da pa ga ni da pa ga ga pa ga re sa ga ga pa da pa ga pa da sa pa da sa ni ga re sa ni da sa re sa ni da sa ni da pa ga pa ga re sa. Ah, 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 ah,
contemporary art and abstract art because I find a lot of similarities between this style and Hindustani music, particularly in the way these two art forms are experienced by the viewer or the listener. Um, I think they both demand quite a bit from the viewer and the listener and the experience requires an individual to really be in tune with their own body, their feelings and their response to the artwork. Um, because it's not something that's just fed to you in a very obvious way. And the process of recognizing whatever the artwork is making you feel is quite a personal and introspective journey. I think both of these art forms share that quality and it really is quite, um, it really says a lot about aesthetics because what are we ultimately feeling when we view something or hear something? If it makes us feel nice, then to ask ourselves why, what about this piece of art is beautiful, and where is, where is beauty, where does beauty reside in music or in art? So these are questions that as artists I think we have to keep asking ourselves and it's part of the journey of discovering our voices and creating art that is meaningful to us. I actually wouldn't consider myself a, a very visual person, but my training in music actually cultivated this aspect of my, this faculty in my brain much more than I expected. Particularly the idea of seeing what you sing rather than just being an auditory exercise. So seeing movement in particular in notes, seeing movement in stillness, uh, these are all concepts that were further reinforced in my musical training and have helped me relate to art in a more meaningful way. Next, I'll be presenting the rag, Bageshri Ang Chandra Kauns. This is also known as Order of Bageshri or Purana Chandra Kauns. And I'll be presenting two bandishes. First bandish is a composition of Pandit Asenratan Chankaji in Japtal, Vighana Har Ganesh. And the Drut composition is a bandish of Pandit Dinkar Kaikini Ji, Brahma Tuma Vishnu Tuma Shambho Mahadeva. And I'll precede these bandishes with a short Nomto Mala.
Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Sagamaga, 
Concluding this recital with Rag Bhairavi, two Bandishki Tumris. The first is a composition of Pandit Dinkar Kaikini ji, and the second one is a composition of Vinod Pia Ustad Tasadduk Khan Sab, also of the Agra Gharana. I just wanted to share a small anecdote about Kaikini ji's Bandish, because it's kind of interesting how composers get inspired to compose. So this bandish in particular was inspired or actually composed while he was sitting on the bus traveling from Churchgate to Opera House. And on the footpath, he saw a bunch of ladies walking. It was Dasara time and they were walking with these kind of clay pots with a diya inside of them. 
So he observed the way they were walking, their gait, their movement. And in that moment, he was inspired to compose this bandish, the, which you'll see is very rhythmically engaged and moves in and out of the tal, inspired by the movement of these women who were walking that day when he composed the bandish. Jalabharat 
हाथ पे कैसे जा पर गढ़ पे जल बर
पन घट पे जल भरन रे मैसे जाऊ पन घट पे जल भरन रे पन घट पे घट घट पे जल जल भरना भरन कैसे कैसे जाऊ कैसे कैसे जाऊ पन घट पे जल भरन घट पे जल बरन रे मैं कैसे जाऊ पर घट पे जल बरन मैं कैसे जाऊ कैसे जाऊ कैसे जाऊ पाय लिया बाजे रे मोरा सया मैं तोरे संगन जाऊंगी पाय लिया बाजे रे मोरा सया मैं तोरे संगन जाऊंगी जाके मोरी सास नन और दोरानी जठनिया लोग मानगर के छर चाकर मार टू न पाय लिया बाजे रे मोरा से हमें तोरे संग न जाऊंगी न जाऊ 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 पाय लिया बाजे रे मोरा से हमें तोरे संग न जाऊंगी बाजे रे बाजे रे बाजे रे पाय लिया बाजे रे मोरा से हमें तोरे संग जाऊंगी जाके मोरी सास मोरी सास ननद सास ननद सास ननद सास ननद और दो रानी जठनिया लोग माना घर के चल चाकर मार टू न पाय लिया बाजे रे मोरा सया में तोरे संग न जाऊंगी अंगिया खसक गई चूड़िया कर रख गई साची में कहत बिनती करत पैया भरत जाऊ मैं तो से हार पाय लिया बाजे रे मोरा से हमें तोरे संग न जाऊंगी पाया लिया बाजे रे मोरा सया में तोरे संग जाओ बाजे रे मोरा सया में तोरे संग जाओ 